Good morning. Um, my name is Ashley and I'm a first first grade teacher here in Texas and this is my chance for teaching. So I'm just kind of going to go kind of, oh my god, I can't even talk. It is Halloween <laughs> and it is, the kids got to wear costumes today, so yeah, a bit crazy. Um, it is my conference. I did not have time to talk to you this morning. So, um, talking to you now. Um, I have to finish my PowerPoint. I didn't get to do, I missed a huge spot when straightening my hair. Look at that. Um, I did not get to do my PowerPoint this weekend. So I am going to finish it now, get it done. And then I have to get some grading done because our, I think this is the third week. So I have to have grades for progress reports. So that is the goal. I will show you when I'm done. It is Halloween and I am leaving today, like right after school. Um, so I can go get my daughter ready and we're gonna go meet cousins and go to the train. So I am out. I did not get to show you what I was doing for today, but I'll do that tomorrow, tomorrow morning, hopefully. Okay guys, I got to school. I had issues with my board, so I had to get that ready and it took me way too long. The kids are about to come, so I can't, like, I was gonna go through what we're gonna do today, but I will get catch up with you during conference. Good morning, guys. So I just got to school and I'm getting all my stuff ready and loaded and pulled up. Um, I have a birthday today, so I have to, I didn't realize I had a birthday today, so I have to quickly get all that ready and good to go. So I'm going to get all their birthday stuff ready and then I'll check in with you in a sec. Okay, so we are during our PLC time, which um, is just an extra time that it's a time that we meet together to talk about, you know, students or things that aren't working that we need to fix. Anything, it's it's really anything, but we don't have anything to talk about today. We're meeting next week to do our RTI plans and stuff like that um, for, the for the next nine weeks or whatever. So even though we're pretty far into it but what, whatever anyways so we are um getting a free chance to just plan so I don't have a lot on my list today that I need to do there was only like I do need a grade and the only thing I didn't, I didn't get done yesterday was my focus wall stuff so if I have time I'm going to work on my paper for school for a little bit and then if I have time I'll work on my focus wall but I still have my conference today so like this is just another hour that we get just to and my watch is charging so it feels weird and it looks weird so yeah but yeah so I'm just going to get done get working with this I did plan for next week already um I don't have all the books I only have one where since voting is next week we're gonna read this book let me get it we're gonna read Dutch for President um I love doing this book for talking about voting um and I finally bought a new one because I got mine from like a garage sale and it was just, it was already very loved by the time I got it. So I bought a new one this year and I'm so excited, but I got Duck for President and um, can't wait to do this with them. So what I usually do is we read the story and then we do like a mock um, election. So, so we'll do our mock, I'm reading this Friday. So we'll do our mock election the next week where um, Friday we'll have like two people be like the presidents or whatever um so i'll have to do it for each class and then we'll just you know run through it and do the voting so i'm really excited about it i like doing this with the kids um so and i honestly i would have done it to where this week was the mock election but i forgot so next year i will do better but yes this is the, the one of the books the other books that we're reading is the very last leaf and olivia or oliver blossom is a cc Oliver Button is a sissy. So we're doing that one. And that's just to talk. We're going to like focus on text to text with that one and connecting to the, like connecting other stories to it. So that's the plan with that. And then, um, it's the big review week because the next week is the test. So I have to give the test the next week, which I have to create the test for that. So I only, I just thought of something I need to add. So I created this. This is like everything I need to get done within a week. And then this is the days that I can do it on. So I just thought of something I need to add to it. Um, so.
so I'm adding that. But that is pretty much it. I'm going to get to work on this and I will talk to you later. Okay. I am respectful. Let's be respectful right now. See if we can earn a letter. Okay, I have a table of contents and a table of contents shows me what? Do you interrupt him? Or are you respectful? Respectful. What is a way that I can have manners? Say yes. That's a great one saying yes, ma'am, no, ma'am, yes, sir, no, sir. That's a great one. If someone holds the door open for me, what should I tell them? Thank you. Thank you. If someone does something nice for me, what should I tell them? Thank you. If someone tells me thank you, what should I what should I say to them? You're welcome. You're welcome. If I need something, do I say I need a pencil? No. 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 May I have a pencil? May I, I have, have a pencil? pencil? Can I please have a pencil? You use those kind words. Oh wow! I see. A new game, but we have to call. Okay, it is conference time. I am about to work on my to-do list. So the only two things I need to do is I need to get like, I need to kind of fix my small group stuff, get them all, get all that all organized. And then I need to do my focus wall stuff. So I actually think I'm gonna do my focus wall stuff first to see how much time I have left. And then I will grab, like put up small group books and go get some new ones. So that's what I'm gonna do next. Okay, so my time is almost up, but I wanted to show you the books because I've pulled all my books I'm doing next week. So I'm doing Oliver Button is a sissy next week. And this is to do like text to text. Um, and then I'm doing, <clears throat> I already showed you this one, Duck for President. And then I'm doing The Very Last Leap. So these are, are my books that I'm doing next week. Um, so I'm going to do Monday, Retail Tuesday. Wednesday, Retail Thursday. And then this is going to be Friday. And we're going to use it all next week too. Because we're going to do our mock um, election or whatever. So <clears throat> hopefully I can get all that done. Now I need to grade. And I need to add my new books into the thing that I printed. So I am hopefully in this next class after I get done with the test and this, the book and everything and get them to centers, I'm hopefully going to get some grading done. So we'll see if I can do this. Okay. I have been plugging away, get my grading done. I'm almost done. This is all the stuff that I'm behind on. I only have two classes left. I'm finishing up mine right now, but I ran out of stickers. So I'm still on Halloween. So I grabbed another Halloween sticker book. I love getting these sticker books from like Michaels or something. And if they make a hundred, they just get a cute little sticker on their paper. So I put a hundred and they get like a little sticker. So I love seeing the little stickers on their papers. So yeah, I'm just finishing this up. I want to get them in the grade book before I have to go to the after school program. And then I am pretty much done. Um, I got everything I needed to do today. I got, so I had like these two buckets right here were full of books. This one and this one um, were full of books that I needed to return. I returned all of them. I picked up a couple of books, um, picked up a couple of extra books that I needed right here for my next group. And then, yeah, so I did all that. I got my focus wall stuff made. It's on the printer. Um, I got tons of grades and y'all it's insane how much grading I did today, but I had the time. So. But that's pretty much it. Um, I'm about to go to the after school program, so I'll catch you later. I wanted to mention real quick while I am heading out to my after school program that if there's anything specific you're wanting me to see, like if you're wanting to see how I lesson plan or if you're wanting to see anything like that, let me know and I can video it. Good morning. It is Thursday. And 
I got to school and I started getting straight to work things or like getting my stuff put up for the day. Um, but um, I got their breakfast thing, lunch count going. So yeah, I am about to um, really need to work on that. Um, I put all my grading stuff up because I'm not gonna do that right now. Um, I'll do that later. And I don't, I'm almost caught up, so that's good. Um, I have one more grade for the other two classes and then I need to get mine done. But other than that, we are all good. I am printing, I'm slowly printing out those retelling books that I have. Um, just trying to get them printed. So yeah, I don't know. But I'm slowly getting through them. So we are moving along. But yeah, so I'm just gonna keep working on this and I'll be right back. I gotta make my to-do list real quick. So I'm gonna do that too. I've been using Google Keep to do my to-do list. I'm gonna do that real quick. Oh, that's something on my phone. Um, I will see you. I'll check with you later. Okay. Open up our books to the first page. I didn't find my book in my bag. What sounds can Edie make? So see if it works. There was no reason to get them up. Good. Some animals stayed in bed until noon. There's an S on the end. Others. There you go. Good morning, y'all. It is Friday. Um, today, I think today's the last football game of the season. So, um, yeah, I need to fix. I just realized I never fixed my schedule yesterday. I only have to change out one thing. Oh, no. So, um, but yeah, so today is the last football game, but there's not a, it's not a home game, so we don't have to, like, go to it or anything and I just lost um we don't have to go to the pep roll or anything which is so nice because it's great that I work at a small school that we're able to do that like the kids love going to the pep rallies it's just it's a lot more stressful for us because it changes our whole schedule and it puts everything like not off but like it moves everything around to where we don't get like our intervention time so I can't get to all my small groups that day. So it just messes everything up. But yeah, so we are moving into Friday. Now I started, I don't know if I told y'all, I started doing this this week, the choices where they could earn letters. And you can tell they didn't earn their letters for their fun Friday. So um, on their fun Friday, I usually let them like get to pick what they want on their computer. They don't have to get on like the program that we use. But they're not going to get to do that today because they didn't earn their letters. So, so sad. Um, I only had, I even had the, this is my homeroom. This is the second group and third group. Third group actually earned one more letter than everyone else, but still not enough. And that's with me giving constant reminders and constantly telling them, hey, you know, I need to change my books. Don't forget, you need to do your, uh, you know, you got to charge this. I just got on my lip. Yep. So I'm going to finish getting all this set up and I'll talk to you in a second. I am finally caught up on grades. So I just finished all like the past weeks. I just have my stack of this week's tests, which I can do those really quick. But 
Um, I gotta switch out my sticker book because this sticker book is for Halloween and this is like November stuff, so I gotta do that. But my next goal is I'm gonna go ahead and get this colored so I can do my anger chart during um, whatever it's called. So I'm gonna do that next. Kids are coming, but I wanna show you how cute it is. Look at how cute. So there you go, I'm done. So I did print out all my stuff that I needed for my anchor chart today. So this is something that I will be working on during my conference. Um, I need to, one of the things I need to do is I need to color my cute little leaf for the book. Um, but right now, before they get in here, I wanna try and get some grading done because I'm behind. So I already made my list in my Google Keep of what I need to do today. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, six things that I need to work on today. Um, so that is the plan. Oh, I just messed up my hair. So I am going to get to grading and I will talk to you later. Okay, so I'm at my conference and I wanted to show you what I'm doing right now. So I'm getting their um, center folders ready for next week. So they all have their own center folder. And in the folder, I haven't done this, but I'm doing it now. They have a Z for the zebra table and an L for the lion table because it's the two tables that we, they do these at. So for my, this one has trash all in it. For my lion table this week, sorry if you hear them, they're, they get like to bring toys and stuff to music today because they earned it or something. So they're getting their toys. Um, this is one of the things they're doing. It's a sequencing based on the story that we're doing. Um, and then they're gonna do this one. Still based on the same story, the very last leaf. This all came in like a pack. I bought a retelling pack off of TPT and I'll leave it linked down below. That's just awesome because I get them after that. I get half of them. And this is the other one. So that's what they're doing at the lion table next week. And then at the writing table, I have two things. They're gonna do this one. They have been working on this in writing class all week. So they've been doing like their their draft, that they've been doing their draft and then their brainstorming in the draft. And then this is one that they're just gonna do on their own based on the other story we're reading next week. Oliver Button is a sissy. So they're gonna have to tell me how this, um, how the character of another book, because we're talking about text to text. So that's why I wanna do this one, how the, that character relates to another character in a story that we read. So that is what they're doing. I'm getting their folders set and ready to go. And then I am going to work on my anchor charts. So okay, I'll, sh I'll like film myself doing the anchor charts or whatever. Okay, so here's a closer look at the first anchor chart that I did. This one I just had to glue the stuff. And then I made three of this next one, text to text, to make connections between stories, and it has the three spots for the three books. And that's where we'll write our connections. So, <clears throat> those are my anchor charts. So I'm done with my anchor chart. I'm done with all the folders I can get done with right now. And then, let's see. Um, I'm not doing my focus wall till the end. I can't do my pencils till the end. Can't do both buttons till the end. 
and I can't do those. I'm just no, I can't do anything else right now, but I can do gradients. I'm gonna grade. <laughs>